spring election is just 11 days away, and Westville school leaders are working hard to spread the word on issue 16. Welcome to Westville Today, your daily neighborhood news video update. I'm Joe Meyer, and here are some of your top stories for Friday, April 24th. The May 5 primary election will not be a crowded affair. Pretty much the only things on the ballot are Issue 1, the Metro Parks Levy, and Issue 16, the Westville City Schools Capital Improvements Levy. Westerville Today asked leaders of the Issue 16 campaign to explain the Westerville School Levy to us. Rick Reno, chairman of the Our Community, Our Schools Levy campaign, and Greg V. Brands, communications director for Westerville City Schools, had this to say. Hello, my name is Rick Reyna. I'm building at Westerville South today just to show you some of the reasons why we're coming forward for Issue 16 on May 5th. Issue 16 is a no new tax, no new millage levy. And what this will provide for is any of the expenditures within the districts that are over five years old. This would be transportation and buses. This would include the heating and cooling systems of our schools. It would include the upkeep and the maintenance of our facilities of the 23 schools within our district. We're asking for your support for issue 16 as we move forward for the election on May 5th. Right now, we are. this is structured because it is a no new tax, no new millage. It also allows us to uh, focus on the continuum period of time. So this will be uh, a permanent levy and it will not be used for uh, operating expenses or teacher salaries. We're constantly looking to get the word out about issue 16 because the public needs to know about the no new taxes, no new millage. I'm Greg V. Grimes. I'm the Executive Director of Communications for Westerville City Schools. And one thing that I think we would like voters to know about Issue 16 is that there is something in this proposed package for every school in the district. There will be repairs, renovations, and improvements to all of our schools, as well as some safety improvements and replacing some of our oldest buses. So everyone benefits from this and it's good for the entire Westerville community. People want to come to a community where people take care of their schools and where they value education, and that is definitely the case. Again, the election is just 11 days off, a week from Tuesday on May 5th.